trip behind the scenes with future country rock blues kings and queens discover them first with palm mash tv palm mash tv It's uh, Palm Mash TV time again. Thank you so much for joining us on another episode. We'll have the interview for you just shortly. But uh, before we begin, uh, don't forget to hit that uh, subscribe button and the bell, and you'll be notified of any new episodes coming your way, of course. And leave a comment on the comment section if you'd like. And uh, we'd like to hear from you there. Go to our Facebook page as well. It's facebook.com forward slash Palm Mash TV. And you can send us an inbox, follow us, uh, comment on the things you see there. And you can email us as well, palmashtv one word at gmail.com. And if you're a band or solo artist and want to be on the show, you can uh, send us an email there and we'll show you how to do that. But we love fan mail as well, so if you're just simply a fan, just send us an email and we'll get back to you. And all this will be uh, uh, recapped at the closing credits at the end of the show, so stay tuned for that. From Columbus, Indiana, we have G.O.D. with us today, very talented artist, and I think you're going to agree, so uh, let's get right to the interview, which starts right now. Okay, as promised, here's the interview, and with us from Columbus, Indiana, we have G.O.D. with us today. Thanks for joining us, G.O.D. You're welcome, sir. Uh, well, tell us a little bit about how it all started for you as far as being an artist goes, because, you know, we all have our different ways of starting out. Uh, tell us how you started out. Um, I started, uh, watching my brothers doing music my whole life. My whole music, my whole family is musical. My dad, he plays guitar. He played guitar, uh, with Van Halen. He got to meet Van Halen, shake his hand. And, uh, I, uh, always watched my brothers rap and I, I freestyled since I was 12, um, I always wanted to be a rapper watching my brothers and then my brothers kind of inspired me to make music. And then after that, it was Eminem for me. Um, and then I battle rap in high school and I did a lot of battle rapping in high school. So I went from a rapper then to a battle rapper and then now I'm rapping again. So, hmm. Well, that's good. I'm glad you got to meet Van Halen. Uh, I think that's a dream for everybody, I think. Yeah, <laughs> I, I, I couldn't believe it myself when he told me so. And, uh, yeah, and of course, as we know, Eddie Van Halen is no longer with us, but uh, he was a legend. I yeah. Think. Uh, and I'm sure he was for you, too, but uh, were there any other inspirations that uh, of famous... Uh, uh, it, um, mainly, uh, it was the hip-hop culture. I really love the hip-hop culture. When I say hip-hop culture, I don't know if you're from familiar with this uh, style of rap um, boom bap like beats uh, it always resonated with me mm -hmm. um, every time I heard a boom bap beat I would always freestyle to it and then whatever I had I would write to it and then make my own songs and get everything going it took me a while to get my own studio when I was young but when I'm back in the day, I went by World Biggest Icon. They still have the account on SoundCloud, but uh, they're about to take it down because that account's not active right now. But the account that I have right now on all platforms is GOG. I need to change that to GOD. And what really just made me want to start rapping is, you know, just the love of hip hop. Mm hmm. You know, watching Tupac rap on, on TV, watching NWA, uh, people like, you know, like C. Dangerous said in his Insane Cloud and Posse, mm -hmm. uh, Lynn Biscuit, Kid Rock, you know, all the greats, you know, and, and what expanded my horizon is just practicing every day in my room. You know, from 8 in the morning until 11 o'clock at night, every night in my mom's in my mom's house. Uh, I would freestyle to beats. I would freestyle to rapper songs. I would freestyle just, just about anything. Uh, that's pretty much how 
my journey started, you know, I started also with a group of friends. Uh, I uh, did a couple songs with Sea Dangerous back in the day, and uh, me and Sea Dangerous started long ways with each other. Me and him were like brothers, you know what I mean? So, uh, yeah, we we go way back uh, since early childhood classes. We've known each other for 23 years. Mm. Yeah, and of course, we had seen Dangerous on our show not long ago, and uh, he really enjoyed being on the show. And, and uh, as a matter of fact, I think uh, the song that we played had you uh, with him doing a kind of a collaboration. Yeah, there, so. yeah uh, the song's called Intentions. Right, Intentions. And that uh, was a great song, and uh, I'm sure everybody loves that. Um, and like you did mention a couple of legends, obviously, you know, like Limp Bizkit and uh, Insane Clown Posse, which was... Uh, see dangerous is uh you know you know inspiration as well and um and, and, you, and you can't go wrong with the legends like them you know um and i think you already mentioned it but name every name some of the places we can find your music and where you are on social media uh right right now you can find me on facebook i'm all over facebook i have a facebook freestyle video uh it's almost to uh, a thousand views it's got 60 likes and 60 comments. Um, you can get me on YouTube. Uh, just look up Scott Newsom, and it will go G-O-D, and it will have my uh, project uh, picture that I'm dropping uh, next month. Um, I put a, together a, a couple of songs with my group, Kings Coalition. Um there's one thing I do want to say before I forget. I don't want to forget. Uh, I want to say shout out to GMG family, you know, for taking us under their wings. If it wasn't from them, none of this would be possible. Uh, so flowers to y'all. I mean, y'all mean the world to us. So we're the, I'm kind of working on a song with Jay Cash Merkham. And don't know what to call the title yet, but uh, it's definitely, definitely something to drop. It's uh, going to be on my project, which is all, all my songs are going to be on all platforms. Um, but yeah, let's get to it before I run my mouth too fast. Uh, you can, you can find me, you can find me on SoundCloud. You can find me on Twitter. You can find me on Instagram. You can find me on YouTube and you can find me on Reverb Nation. Okay, so SoundCloud or Reverb Nation is about the only streaming formats where they find you right now, right? Yeah, and YouTube. Okay. All right, we'll go to SoundCloud, Reverb Nation, YouTube, so forth, as he mentioned, and uh, get his stuff. I know he would love you for that. And uh, we're getting ready to play uh, a video by him right now. It's called Drone. I know it's probably self-explanatory, but tell us a little story about this song. Um, I'm dealing with something kind of in my life. I feel like I'm drowning in anxiety right now because my, uh, I've been trying to reach out to my dad for a while and my mom's been dead for five years now. Um, and it's just been kind of hard for me just to, I, I had to take three months off of music because of it. And, uh, I just had to get my life together and everything in order to just to get music going. But the story behind it is just pretty much on faith. You know, whenever you're dry on faith, you get this anxiety. Does God love me? Does God want me? Does God appreciate me? When we all know the truth, God does appreciate you. God does care about you. He cares about each and every one of us. If he didn't care about us, he wouldn't die on the cross. And he wouldn't send his son to die on the cross for us, you know, in Jesus Christ, you know. Um, I, I, it's pretty much, you know, just struggling with faith, you know, struggling with reading the Bible, struggling with trying to pray to God, struggling with trying to go back to church. You don't know if they're going to judge you or love you or if it's going to feel the same. Um, it, it, it's just a story behind itself. It's, it's deep storytelling. And I think all the people are going to like it. Okay. Yeah, it is a great song. And, uh, we're going to get to that in just a second, but, uh, uh, G.O.D., we thank you so much for being on the show. Uh, come back anytime you want to and plug something new if you'd like. You're welcome, buddy. I, I'm honored to be on your show, Paul. Okay, well, I well, I appreciate that. And let's get right to the song, Drown, and it starts right now. And 
And what do, what do I tell the person who is too tired to go on? What do I tell the one who says, I'm too tired? God said, tell him, I got tired too. It's time to say goodbye right now Cause I don't wanna be alive right now I wanna be six feet in the ground Where I can't even hear a sound Put me in the water where I'll drown Yeah, G-O-D Where I'll drown Where I'll drown Father, forgive me for my sins, cause I am only human I make mistakes every day, tell me who doesn't I am perfect, cause I'm a sinner I try to call out to you, but I don't think that you listen Right now, all I'm hearing is crickets I walk on your doorstep just to see if you're home Come to find out it's me alone at the altar Crying to your statue, that's attached on the cross Can you show me the path that I need to be on? Cause right now, I feel lost I ain't going to any churches, I straight from the pack I was a part of a family, but then my greediness got in the way Here lately I ain't been the same, I wanna ask forgiveness but I'm afraid Would they love me or judge me or would it even feel the same? Would they accept me with open arms if I went back with anything changed? Would they just remain the same or would continue not to change? I pray for brighter days cause right now I'm feeling pain Dear Lord Calling out to you, God. Here lately, just ain't been the same for me. I just feel in my head too much. Dealing with the anxiety and depression. Dealing with anger and regret. I just need you to take this away from me, God. Can you hear me? Are you gonna act like I'm not here? Answer me! It's time to say goodbye right now. I don't wanna be alive right now I wanna be six feet in the ground Where I can't even hear a sound Put me in the water where I drown Where I'll drown Where I'll drown I don't even know anymore I'm tired of feeling sore I'm sick of all these walls I'm sick of the demons at my door I'm falling on my knees And I'm giving on to you, God I don't know if I should trust you But I'm living your life I'm living the Christian style I don't know if I can make it happen But I'm drinking the soda Trying to make this magic I'm witnessing all this madness Taking these pills up down the drain But I don't know if you hear me Cause I'm not okay I'm afraid of the past I'm afraid of the future I'm afraid of right now And what is coming sooner I know that you can hear me I don't know what you be thinking I don't know if you can witness me Drinking the whiskey that I'm thinking I'm falling down on my knees And I need a break I don't know if you can hear me But I'm trying to escape Take this bullet from me God And make it all go away Make me happy once again And not feel afraid